that if you spotlight quote-unquote reality, which is grim, which deals with poverty, which deals with uh, the grim, dark issues of life, that's the only time when you touch reality. But sexuality is something which we live with all the time from birth to death. In the inner worlds, these are the demons that you grapple with in your own unique ways. And I think uh, what Vikram has done in the second decade of the 21st century is to fearlessly confront what is playing out in our cities, in our small towns, and hold the mirror to you and say, this is what's playing out. Now, those who find truth shocking, I ask, is truth shocking or the lies you tell to run away from the truth more shocking? So I feel that what Love Games does is spotlights the reality that there is as the loneliness in your metros increases on the hour by the hour, as social connectivity increases in Twitter and Facebook, WhatsApp, there are not only lonely cities, but the nation itself is getting lonely. And irrespective of what is being poured into your home through your uh, media outlets, they're le they kind of there's a hunger in each one of us to stick, to, to find something meaningful, to find an enduring relationship. So against the background of the social truth, there is a narrative uh, which Vikram has crafted, which is an edge on the seat experience, but which kind of fearlessly looks at what is happening in India. Every, as we know, the, India has changed in the last 10, 15 years more than it has changed in 3,000 years. And most of you who saw this, you know about this reality. But in the heart of this is there's also what is called the craving for an enduring, meaningful love story. You also deal with career women, women who are very successful, but who are living in their homes battered by their husbands and you deal with uh, the loneliness of the super rich who amuse themselves to death. Patralekha who played this fantastic role in City Light is now seeing going to be visible to you from the on the other side when she made her foray into the world of movies she came uh, as a girl who comes from rural India into the bad big bad city but here she plays the role where she has been very brave to dare to embrace a role which looks at the city and the Indian reality from the other side. Tashu, my little girl, has been very brave to play a role which has been there. Her performance has not been referenced from, from any actor or actress that I have seen on the Indian screen. She has brought her own understanding her own truth to this role. And Gaurav is going to be a major force to reckon with in times to come. He's going to be there in the front rows of the entertainment industry. And Vikram Bhatt, after the disaster of Mr. Rex, has dared to once again say, I want the world and I want it on my terms. I'm going to say things as they are in the idiom that I choose to speak in. So he has taken a brand new star cast, taken a theme which is very brave, which tackles the need for a conservative traditional relationship and also deals with the hideous reality where pleasure is the be all and the end all of everyone. And he marries the, the narratives, these two streams, like a brilliant craftsman and gives you an experience which you will wake up to on the 8th. We are confronting the reality in these times where non-star cast films have a very, very tough time negotiating the, the media spends of very uh, big budget films. But here we are 
with our innovative promos. We have given you a taste of what you may have in store for you. And I think having sampled that, I think we hope to create enough interest to get bums on the seat on the 8th of April on Judgment Day. And I'm certain when the consumer comes in, he will taste it and go out and scream out that there is something meaningful and entertaining. And I think I'm a, it's a film that I have uh, enjoyed making where I've seen uh, the young talent emerge. I've seen them dare and I've seen Vikram emerge and hold on to his fort and say things as he sees them. What more can a film producer, maker, who has chosen to live life on his own terms, expect from his junior? He is walking tall and his journey is just beginning. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Questions? Anyone? Wow. <laughs> How active is the scene of swinging in your world, my friend? Na tu khuda hai na mera ishq farishton jaisa dono insaan hai to kyun itne hijabon mein mile? It's time to hang it on the trees, man. The times are no longer there now to take an exalted moral position where you say you deprave people you live a permissive life and you contaminate this pure world that we belong to. I know a lot more about your proclaimed purity. I have seen it from the insides. And what we bring to you is the pretensions of that pure class, which pretends on the, by the day to be something else but lives a different life. And it is that which Vikram has spotlighted. And uh, so to, I think to divide society into Bollywood, a uh, political class, journalistic class is silly, like you cannot draw uh, lines on a stream of, uh, on the river and tear it into parts. We can't dip, kind of uh, divide society into slices. Uh, but sir, yeah, uh, this film musics are very good. Uh, there are seven soundtracks. I have so all are in, so there are seven tra uh, soundtracks in this movie and all are decided by you only. Uh, so, what was your, uh, like, uh, what you were thinking about uh, when you was uh, Soundtracks this, by this man. Uh, soundtrack, you said songs? Songs? Actually, uh, she is going by a news that there are seven films in this film. But that is like a background score. There are seven films in this film, but they are in the background. There are five Hindi films in this film. In this world, these people are in this world, they 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 are in this world. तो इसके इसका जो वॉलपेपर है इसकी जो एक्यूस्टिक है इसके इस तरह आप फाइव स्टार होटल के स्पेस पे जाते हैं तो वहाँ पर आपको अंग्रेजी गाने सुनने को ज़्यादा मिलते हैं यानी हिंदी नहीं तो वो एक माहौल का एक आम्बियांस का एक रिक्रिएशन है इनका